But I can tell you in observing people who have healed themselves of very serious health conditions, who've healed themselves of some pretty difficult scars and from the past, who've overcome addictions, who've created new opportunities and new uh, jobs and new uh, relationships and a new life, had to cross that river. And that is when they're literally, by a lot, from a biological standpoint, a new personality. And your personality creates your personal reality. That's it. And your personality is made up how you think, how you act, and how you feel. So the present personality who's sitting here today has created the present personal reality called their life. Which means then, if you want to create a new personal reality, you got to change your personality. And that means you got to start thinking about what you've been thinking about and change it. Look at your unconscious habits and behaviors, what you say, what you do, and become conscious of it. And change them. And look at the emotions that have kept you anchored to the past and decide if those emotions belong in your future. And I think the biggest problem is that most people try to create a new personal reality as the same personality, and it doesn't work. So then as we begin to demystify this, and the person starts to say, oh my God, the disease that I have is because it's connected to this personality. Is it possible that if I change my personality, just like a person with a multiple personality disorder, who has an allergy to nylon stockings in one personality and, and type 1 diabetes in another, is it possible that if I change my personality, that the disease exists in the old personality and I'm literally someone else, is it possible then from a biological standpoint that they're healed and changed? So to answer the question, it's difficult because we're breaking out of a biological mold. It's difficult because most people don't know that they have within their reach all the tools to do it because they have, number three, been conditioned on some level to believe that the new hairstyle or the new uh, type of beer they're going to drink or the sports car or whatever it is is going to change their state. 